स्टूडेंट टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट चैप्टर नंबर टू दैट इज अ पोएम मिडो सरप्राइजेस इट इज रिटन बाय लुएस ब्रैंड फिलिप्स इन दिस पोएम द पोएट डिस्क्राइब्स अबाउट द नेचर लेट मी टेल यू द समरी फर्स्ट अ मिडो इज अ ग्रीन फील्ड व्हिच कैन होल्ड मेनी सरप्राइजेस फॉर अस द ब्यूटी ऑफ सच अ प्लेस कैन बी सीन बाय ओनली दोस पीपल who have a very keen eye and sharp ears the poet advises us to walk very softly through the green grass and to try to enjoy the music of the stream flowing by he also tells to see the butterfly resting upon a flower and sipping its juice it is possible that we may frighten a rabbit and make it run away one can also blow a dandelion flower and its free parts fly in the air green fields have houses like bureaus in the ground or birds nest or ant hills under the tall grasses the poet also emphasizes upon the fact that all this can be seen only by those people who look for it kindly or when we lend our ears on them yes now i will read out the stanzas and tell you the meaning as surprises you can find them if you look walk softly through the velvet grass and listen by the brook here the poet want to describe that if one pays attention a meadow has several surprises to offer it is a great pleasure to walk through the velvety soft grass and hear the sound of the brook what is brook here brook is the uh, stream which is short the shorter than the river now stanza number 2 you may see a butterfly rest upon a buttercup and unfold its drinking straws to sip the nectar up here in this stanza the poet describes the beautiful sight one may encounter in the meadows in the meadows it is possible to come across a butterfly comfortably placed upon her buttercup or flask which is full of nectar it would seem as if i is sipping nectar from the buds and flask with the help of a drinking straw now in the third stanza you may scare a rabbit who is sitting very still though at first you may not see him when he hops you will here in this stanza the poet about that walking on the soft grass one may not be immediately able to see the rabbit which is hiding there the rabbit might get frightened by our footsteps and would hop out of grass and that is a indeed sight worth watching next stanza a dandelion whose fuzzy head was golden days ago has turned to airy parachutes that flutter when you blow here the poet describes the sights of buds transforming into flowers dandelions of bright yellow flowers that appeared golden several days ago have bloomed and flutter as you go near and blow at them if you blow at them they used to bloom now in the next stanza explore the meadow houses the bureaus in the ground a nest beneath tall grasses the ants amazing move poet describes certain houses that are seen in the meadows if one explores the meadows one comes across various houses there are bureaus in the ground meant for smaller animals some nests are found beneath the tall grass and moons for the ants are also there now in the next stanza oh meadows have surprises and many things to tell you may discover these yourself if you look and listen well in this the poet describes that the fact that a meadow has several surprises if one is able to pay a little attention look and listen very listen well you may find several beautiful surprises in the meadows so this is all about the poem hope you understood thank you